it's going to add a good touch because this hat is not going to be your average hat. This is not your everyday hat. When you want to make a statement on your shady day, this is the hat that you will wear. Hi, welcome to my channel. I am Janicia, the hat maker behind Shady Days. And here we are all about hat making. Uh, we make handmade hats and customization. In today's video, we'll be talking about scrawl hats and I'll be decorating this one. And I'll put in a clip of me actually getting this ready and how it looked before it was actually dyed and painted. Okay, let's get started on customizing this hat. What I have in mind is um, a white, like natural tannish uh, ribbon. We're gonna do a sewn bow and I'm gonna do some cording and I'm gonna add a touch of gold. So we're gonna, I'm gonna let this play out while we kind of talk about the different um, types of scrawl material. And there are so many different types of scrawl hat material that's out there. This particular one is made from Panama scrawl. You have, to just to name a few, you have raffia, you have parasol, you have a uh, weak scrawl, you have braided hemp, and you have paper scrawl, etc. So many different types. Right now, I am getting ready to sew this first part of the ribbon band on. Also, another thing that I want to share about the scrawl materials, like this particular one, it had to be stiffened to get it to have a stiff frame if, if that's the style that you, you know, want to achieve in the process, in the designing process. So, stiffening the scrawl is a part of the process if that's the desired outcome. Okay, here I have a yellow piece of ribbon that I'm gonna use here as an accent on the ribbon. And we're gonna do this white creamish color with the yellow accent on the inside and I already have it uh, prepared and cut to how I need it. We're going to put this and fold this over so this is going to be the detailing here on the ribbon. So I'm going to get ready to do that. Okay, I have the accent middle piece of the bow finished and now I'm going to pre prep the the accent ribbon for one of the tails of the bow. Okay, the accent has been in place how I, I desire for it to be. So I like to put, I like it to be a little wing here. A little extra wing on the bow end. And I'm gonna get ready to stitch that on. I prefer to stitch on these elements instead of gluing but that's in the preference of the individual to how they would like to, you know, to secure these elements to the hat. So I, you know, stitch everything in place. Okay guys, the bow has been secured and everything is finished and is in place. So um, now I'm gonna get ready to add some other elements. And please let me know in the comments if you're interested in seeing exactly how the bow is actually put together, how what different pieces it requires for the ribbon and the different cuts and the corners that the stitching is and anything like that. Just let me know in the comments and I will actually make a video to actually show that in more detail. But let's move on with getting this hat complete. All right, to add a little more flair to this hat, I decided to go with adding this gold leather cord to the base at the very, very bottom. I think this adds, it's gonna add a good touch because this hat is not gonna be your average hat. This is not your everyday hat. When you want to make a statement on your shady day, this is the hat that you will wear. So I want to add some gold to this and I'm going to secure it with one of these metal uh, flat sliders. Thank you. 
look at this what a nice touch this is on here such a great touch and layers are everything when it comes to customizing the hat if you want to make a statement piece and yes the clean slick modern looks are always great as well those are always great looks as well but if you want to go for something that's just color just like wow color and layers that's the way to go right now i'm just sealing the ends of this ribbon well this core sorry sealing the ends of this core and getting ready to put the cap on the end right. this around and secure it all right i have my core how i like it and that is there. All right, I'm gonna do some stitching. And this hat is nearly complete. Okay, now we have a finished look. This is all the final details. Stitching here and some stitching to the back. Also, I almost forgot to show the inside of the head. This is um, a cloth sweatband sewn inside and with the ribbon to indicate the back of the head and the tag, the Shady Days tag. So. All right, thanks for joining me as I complete this hat and like and subscribe and continue to follow my hat making journey. Thank you so much.